Hello everybody! In today's video, we will discuss the updated Microsoft Edge browser to find out if it's really so good as they say. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you'll be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. By now, a browser is one of the most important programs on every computer. We use it daily to surf the web, read the news, do some online shopping, access social networks, and engage in many other activities. For all these purposes, uh, this is the app that we've been using for many years. However, if the range of browsers to choose from was quite limited before, these days the choice is really good. Today I'm going to show you the best things you can get from the new Microsoft Edge based on Chromium. We will analyze the peculiarities of the latest version, explore its functionality to understand if it is good enough to replace your favorite browser right now. By the way, the updated Edge got a new logo as well. You can download the updated browser from the Microsoft official website. When you open the old Microsoft Edge, the patch for downloading the updated version will open automatically. Just click on this button. As you can see, the new product is available for Windows 10, 8 and 7, macOS, iOS and Android. It can work with mobile devices and supports over 90 languages. Windows 10 users can get the new Edge as a part of the latest system update. Alright, uh, let's see what's new inside the updated browser from Microsoft. The first and the most important peculiarity of the Chromium-based Edge is its close integration with the Microsoft Online Services. By default, it supports user authentication for Microsoft accounts and synchronization of user data across a variety of devices. Also, it is closely linked to Bing Search Engine, Microsoft News, Microsoft Translator, and other services provided by Microsoft. With all that, you can change now how the browser works with Microsoft services, and you can even disable some of them if you want. Another point of pride for developers is customized tabs. In the browser settings, you can select layout, design and contents of a new tab, disable background images, news and quick links. Special attention is paid to ensuring privacy and security when working online. In addition to the smart screen model for protection against phishing and malware, which is inherited from the classic Edge, the updated browser also includes a system to protect users from being tracked while they surf the web. This new feature is enabled by default, has three levels of settings, and ensures blocking all kinds of web trackers and scripts used by advertising and analytical agencies to follow people's activities online. It can be turned on for all websites or turned off for specific web resources. The strong point in the new Edge is that you can add extensions both from Microsoft Edge add-ons uh, currently there isn't much stuff to choose from and from Chrome Web Store with its thousands of useful apps. And this is something we can't help welcoming. The updated Edge implements a number of other interesting features. They include support for Azure Active Directory, 4K video streaming, using digital ink to write things in PDF files, read aloud option for websites, and a dark theme for the browser to look as trendy as possible. Let's add some more detail on the new functionality. When you start the browser for the first time, you'll be suggested to customize the new tab. There are three ways to go – focused, inspirational, and informational. One more point is collections. Collections let you gather, arrange in a certain way and export to a number of file formats the information collected from various websites, or return to your search and continue right from the point where you stopped. These days, doing that could be quite a challenge, especially if you have to deal with lots of websites and do it from several devices. When you click on the Collections button, here on the right in your browser, a panel will appear. Now you can drag and group web pages, text and images, 
and you don't need to open another page or another application to do it all. When you are finished, you can export this collection into Microsoft Word or Excel. Also, you can share it by copying into Outlook or another mail service. If you are an active Internet user who typically visits tons of websites and has dozens of tabs open so the whole picture becomes uh, a bit confusing, Edge is out there to help you with the convenient vertical tab feature. Use it to find the tab you need easily and manage all the tabs stacked at the side of the browser with a single click. One of the most important features in this browser is blocking trackers, and it is essential for ensuring privacy and security for anyone using the Internet. In fact, this feature comes as an addition to the integrated smart screen system. In the settings, you can select one of the three options – basic, balanced or strict. Depending on your choice, Microsoft Edge will decide what should be blocked. This feature is enabled by default and it will help users to detect and manage applications that are trying to track them online. For example, you can choose what specific trackers to block. Talking of private tabs, if you ever used Google Chrome, you must know this feature. When surfing the web, you can open a tab as an in-private window. Search history won't be linked to your current account, and when you close such window, your browsing history, cookies, and website data will be removed automatically. These days, many users watch movies from online resources. So far, Edge is the only browser for Windows allowing you to watch Netflix in 4K and supporting Dolby Audio and Dolby Vision. Also, there is one more convenient option that lets you have useful links right on your taskbar. Just open a page in the browser, click on the three dots button and select the line Pin this page to the taskbar. The shortcut will appear in the taskbar immediately. What is more, built-in support for PDF files lets you view and exchange them right from the browser window. The new Microsoft Edge can be downloaded by anyone. If you haven't received it in the latest update for your operating system, I'll give the download link in the description under this video. So what's the bottom line for the new Microsoft product? In fact, it's no different from many other similar apps, just as good as any of them. Yes, there's a certain bit of novelty, especially for those who use the good old Edge for many years before. If you are one of such users, then it does make sense to install the updated version and enjoy web surfing with higher speed and improved functionality. But for people who favored other browsers before, it's very unlikely to make a difference. And that is all for now. Hopefully this video was useful. Remember to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Push the bell button to receive notifications and never miss new videos. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck.